Hey guys, I'm Nick and welcome back to the channel. Or if you happen to be new here, please don't forget to click that subscribe button to stay current and up to date with all the latest Star Trek news on YouTube. So today I'm talking to you about the new promo photos that have come out to promote episode 11 of Star Trek Discovery Season 3 entitled Sukal. It initially was entitled The Citadel, but the name has been changed recently uh, and it is now Sukal, whatever that happens to mean. We, I'm sure we'll find out very soon. So we're going to run through all these new promo photos that have come out to promote the new episode. And let's start by going through the synopsis for this episode to see how that reads, which is as follows. Discovery ventures to the Veruban Nebula where Burnham, Saru and Kalba make a shocking realisation about the origin of the burn as the rest of the crew faces an unexpected threat. So based on the trailer for this episode that uh, I had a video on uh, just the other day, and if you haven't seen my video breakdown of the trailer for this episode, be sure to click on the link up here to check that one out. But it's got weird things going on there in this planet. It's all kind of destroyed. We've got Burnham in Trill makeup. We've got Culber in Bajoran makeup. It all seems a bit bizarre. So let's take a look at these photos and see if we can learn anything new about the episode. So for starters, we've got a shot here of Tilly, Saru and Burnham in uh, the ready room, probably going over a briefing of some description about what they're facing, but apparently it seems from the synopsis that we're going to have half of the crew in terms of Burnham, Saru and Kalba on the away mission and we're going to have the rest of the crew back up on the ship. So does this mean Tilly is going to be left in command of the Discovery? If so, that will be uh, interesting to see how that pans out as First Officer. Let's take a look at our next shot. Burnham in sick bay holding book's cat grudge and she's got kind of a uh, a smile on her face so unlike tilly uh, it would seem like burnham is uh, more of a cat person than tilly is because she looks quite pleased to be uh maybe uh, babysitting or looking after grudge in this episode. In this next shot, it looks like uh, we've got part of the same scene. So we've got uh, Book and Burnham, this time Book holding grudge and uh, Dr. Pollard looking on. Not a great deal we can ascertain from, uh, from this image. And we've got Book <laughs> and Dr. Pollard again with Grudge the Cat. CBS likes to do these photos to us where they don't really like to give away very much in their promo photos. I mean, uh, there's a bit of repetition I've found in this week's photos. It's like, uh, you know, obviously they, they show quite a bit in their trailers in terms of what's going on on the away mission and the planet. Their promo photos are perhaps a little bit generic with not much to give away in terms of our plot for this week. Um, and another shot of uh, Book and <laughs> Grudge and Dr. Pollard. Maybe Grudge the cat's getting a bit of a checkup. Maybe she's got a fur ball or, or something uh, stuck in her throat and, uh, and Dr. Pollard has to take it out or some, uh, something similar. Because they don't really have vets on board Starship, so I guess doctors probably have to double as vets in th that capacity, I would imagine. And another shot of Book, big smile on his face. These all seem like they're part of the same scene to me. We've got all of them in sick bay. We've got Burnham with a smile on her face, with holding grudge. We've got Book with a smile on his face. It seems like a very happy sort of scene. Pollard there too. And we've got another sh another shot of Burnham holding grudge the cat. Uh, is, come on, CBS. There's a bit of repetition going on with these photos. I think they needed to uh, you know show a few planetary shots, a few shots down on the planet. We've we've obviously uh, can see they've got some uh, Bajoran and Trill makeup and stuff going on, and some weird Inception-like photos of staircases and weird landscapes moving around with ominous doorways and all this kind of stuff going on with with ships arriving in orbit and all this sort of stuff. So we. Know this kind of stuff's going on, so it's not like we're trying to avoid spoilers in this regard. So I'm, I'm sort of kind of surprised that we've had so many photos in this new lineup of promo photos that are kind of showcasing the same scene. And okay, we've got one on the bridge now. Saru and Burnham and uh, and Book. It looks like we're mid uh, battle sequence here. Saru's having a bit of a bit of a lean. Uh, I'm sure all of the the crew are doing the usual thing where the camera rocks to one side and everybody jolts to one way. We've got some sparks and some steam vent from the uh, vent in the background there. Based on the trailer, uh, it appears that um, we've got an emerald chain ship or something showing up. So if I had to guess from this scene, we've obviously got a way team 
on the planet in the Veruba Nebula and we've got our crew back up on the ship and there's obviously been some sort of altercation between a emerald chain showing up and whether there's uh, going to have to the ship's going to have to leave and come back for them because it looks like this new uh, emerald chain ship that shows up uh, is a little bit bigger than the last one that uh, this discovery encountered back in that episode where we met Book's brother. And we've got a shot of Burnham and Book at uh, at the station on the Discovery Bridge here. Smoke in the background, so this would probably be part of the uh, battle sequence between the Discovery and the Emerald Chain, if I had to guess. Or it could be, they could just be getting bumped around a bit on their journey into the nebula, because uh, it looks like it's a bit of a rough ride getting into the Veruba Nebula, and there's a planet, and it's all busted up, and all that sort of thing. So maybe it's... Um, it's part of their journey in to find out the mystery of, uh, of whatever's going on in there with that uh, Kelpian ship. Another shot of uh, Burnham here on the bridge. We've got the nebula on uh, the display screen there next to Burnham. It actually says on the screen there Veruba Nebula. So maybe this is part of the yeah, part of the journey into the nebula, which is a bit of a bit of a bumpy ride for our crew. Shot of Burnham on the bridge at a science station on the Discovery. And a shot of Saru in the command chair, captain's chair on the bridge. And a shot of Tilly on the bridge, we've got more uh, Veruba Nebula graphics going on. In the background there, I think there's like three or four monitors, all with the Veruba Nebula on it. There's a bit of navigating to be done to get into where they need to be, it would seem, in this episode. The synopsis does read quite interestingly, so I hope the actual episode pays off, because, yeah, because the, the synopsis reading, um, the Discovery ventures to the Veruba Nebula where Burnham, Saru, Culber make a shocking realisation about the origin of the burn as the rest of the crew faces an unexpected threat. So I hope that the um, the shocking realisation of the burn is revealed in this episode, and then I'm guessing if that is in fact the case, we will get the last two, because we're up to episode 11, there's 12 and 13, so two more episodes left after this week's one, um, will be, I guess... To solve the burn situation, I think it, it, we have to realise what it is and what caused it, and I guess the next step after that is to finding out how do we fix it. So that will be very interesting if that's in fact what we do get, because we've had episodes before where the uh, synopsis has read very enticing and uh, seems like it's going to give a, a huge realisation, and then it hasn't really kind of maybe delivered as much as we thought it might. So hopefully, fingers crossed, uh, in the case of this week's episode, that will in fact be the case. Uh, guys, with my next video coming up, which will be the review of uh, this episode, Sukal episode 11 of Discovery Season 3, it's probably going to be a day or two later than what I would normally put it out, because obviously we've got Christmas Eve and, uh, and Christmas Day coming up. I think the uh, episode is due to air on Christmas Eve. Uh, obviously lots of, you know, everybody's got lots of family commitments and everything on, uh, on Christmas Eve, so um, um, I'm <laughs> no different. Uh, so I'll probably be putting out my review uh, on Boxing Day uh, or thereabouts for that episode. So uh, uh, have a look out for that. But uh, yeah, apologies uh, if, it's a, if it's a day or two later than it normally is. But you know, holiday season and all that sort of thing. So I wish you guys all the very best to, to you and your families uh, in this holiday season. Have a great Christmas. Uh, and uh, I will catch you guys uh, for my uh, next review for the episode 11 after Christmas and uh, in the meantime yeah you know like comment share subscribe <laughs> check out merch check out membership all that sort of thing uh, and I'll see you guys very soon happy holidays and Merry Christmas to everyone